Hello and welcome from the California Our Ladies Army of Advocates Conference. My name is Father Albert and I will be answering some of your questions. Can the Church relax or even do away with the requirement of priestly celibacy? The requirement of priestly celibacy goes back right to the beginning of the Church, in fact, beginning with our Lord. And tradition tells us also that St. John of the Apostles um, was not married, and quite quickly that became the custom in the Church was that the priests would not be married. And there's a fittingness to this custom, um, firstly because priests, cry, um, priests are other Christs, alter Christus, uh, especially in Mass. When the priest says Mass, he says the words consecration in persona Christi, so it's actually Christ himself who's speaking um, at Mass when the priest says Mass. So it's most fitting that he be chaste, just as our Lord was chaste. That's the fundamental reason. Um, that's also why Our, our Lady um, was a virgin, because of her close union with Christ, who was God. Um, so there's a great fittingness that Christ be celibate. And, as I said, it's a tradition of the Church from the beginning, and especially already in the third, four centuries, they were, it became a law. It's true that in the, some Oriental churches, they allowed priests to be married, but it was more a tolerance than anything else. And it was only something for priests who were not to have a, a position that was very important. Um, simply, simply also because being married, they, they don't have the time <laughs> to occupy themselves wholly, solely with, with the church as, uh, priests who aren't married can. Um, and bishops have never been able to be married in, even in the, or in the Eastern church. Um, so to answer your question, it would not be, certainly would not be traditional, um, for this law to be done with, it would almost be like changing the Mass. Um, it's something that has gone on for so long. Uh, it's something that the Church doesn't really have power over anymore. Um, the Church hasn't, can't just change everything. And something as fundamental as this law of priestly celibacy um, that's been in the, in the Church for centuries and centuries and centuries, that's not something that the Church can just change it on, on a whim. Thank you for watching, and may God bless you.